Sir Joe, let's go. We got some bad right, news go. for you guys. Now, Cyberpunk has been delayed again, all the way till December 10th this year, not next year, don't worry. It's still coming out this year. Um, however, it will be ineligible for Game of the Year, but I know there's gonna be a lot of fans, like my boy Sergio over here, that are a little pressed. I know Sergio's a little salty that Cyberpunk has been delayed for like the 20th Oh, you have time. no idea. <laughs> so Sergio, please tell the audience about, um, you know, why are you not hyped anymore? Like, why are you upset about this delay for this um, game that's it, coming out? They just keep on delaying it too much. This is like, what, the fourth, fifth time that they delayed again? Yeah. Like, come on, like, November was supposed to be, like, my games to play. <laughs> There's just too many games now coming out during November. Yeah, I mean, you got Call and of Duty, Watch Dogs Legion comes out on, like, the 29th, and... You know, you got Assassin's Creed, and yeah, Assassin's Creed, Call of Duty, just, this is a lot of stuff coming out in November, but I guess that gives us a little bit more wiggle room to uh, play those titles, but it is interesting how they delayed this, and just the speech, or just the comments that they had to make about this. Now, over this, you can read this on their social media pages, like Twitter, and they made this official announcement. Now, they said that they were just trying to basically polish up the quality and release all nine versions of cyberpunk now this includes xbox one and xbox one x and then compatibility on the xbox series x and then the ps4 and then the ps4 pro compatibility and then they're trying to work on that with the ps5 then the pc and then google stadia which i'm not going to judge anyone who plays on the google stadia but it is kind of questionable but it sounds like they are have a lot on their hands or they're just trying to release it all at the same time as what they basically imagined now they did say that the game went gold though that, that's good it can then be completed you know it's a fully developed game right but they said in this comment them that they don't they don't really have to stop making the quality a little bit better so i don't know i'm kind of getting sus about this whole i mean i know sergio can probably talk about this i mean sergio i mean just tell me more about what you think about this all i can say is cd project i to twitter <laughs> i wish i took a screenshot of the conversation but the guy was asking he's like hey is it being released in november like i said 100 confirmed before i request off then they tweeted back saying Yes, we can confirm it's coming out this month. Wait, Not I know what you're talking about. Later. It's on Twitter. No, somebody took a screenshot because I saw... Yep, I see it. It's on Twitter. Oh, I'm putting that in the upload. Everybody can see it. <laughs> yes, please. We, we need to. But yeah, after what? Less than 24 hours, they bring that news saying, Hey, we're sorry, but we're going to delay it. It's like, guy, you just fucking lied to the consumers. Yo... Yo, I really feel bad for anyone. Oh my gosh. Yo, I really feel bad for anyone that really took a day off. Oh my gosh. I mean, a lot of people were going to request a weekend off for it. Uh, oh man. I, dude, everybody's going to request like holidays off because, you know, December 10th is, you know, usually typically around the holiday season and stuff like that. But I know a lot of people can be busy during that month, but. Dang, just the fact that, you know, this this delay just came out of nowhere. Like, I literally, what, Sergio, I woke up, Chris texted me, and literally he said Cyberpunk got delayed. And I thought he was just joking with me because, you know, Cyberpunk's been delayed for, like, what, three times now? And I was just, I thought More it was like a joke. More like four or five already. Dude, I don't even know how many delays they've had, but I don't know. It's just crazy to me to think that... Now this game is going to be ineligible for Game of the Year, technically this year, and it will be eligible next year, but just very unfortunate for CD Projekt Red. Um, you know, I'm a little... I'm a little mixed about this game now, like, I think gameplay-wise, it's good, the amount of content it has, just amazing. However, I'm just a little mixed on these delays, and these delays are kind of crushing, I'm sure it's crushing your hype. I mean, you were about to pre-order it, weren't you? You were literally I mean, I was going to pre-order this weekend, but not anymore, it was like, <laughs> I'm not going to pre-order something if it's going to keep on getting delayed over and over. Yeah, like... Like, I understand they have to hype the game up, like, that's how all game companies do it now.
But it's just getting annoying where these game companies are just keep on delaying their games way too long. Yeah. And like, why are you announcing a game like, you know, years before that's not even like close to even being finished? Like, please announce it when it's close to being finished. Yeah, exactly. Like, I don't know. Like, it just doesn't feel right for it to be getting delayed this much. Like, you know, I feel like if they have a release date, then I feel like that should be an official release date, especially, you know, when you're putting that publicly, you know, on Twitter or, you know, Facebook, just like publicly out there. Like, when you say that, okay, November, I don't know what was it, like, November 10th or like 19th or whatever, you know, November is going to be the month when you can play Cyberpunk. And then when they say, hey, we're moving it to December, then, you know, that's kind of unfortunate and kind of inconvenient for a lot of players, I know, when it comes to video game delays. But understandably, it is 2020 and, like, people are going through a pandemic. But, you know what? We just gotta get this game, man. We gotta get our hands on with this game. I mean, Sergio, are you still, after all this, are you still going to pre-order Cyberpunk? Because I know for you personally, you're like a typical guy. I'm probably gonna wait till like the last week where it should be basically confirmed. Like, worst thing they could do is like delay it last minute. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I know Rockstar has done that before, but... <laughs> <laughs> at least, at least it turned out good, so you can complain. That is true. But still, though, like true. delaying, you delayed your game way too many times, City Project Red. Yeah. Like you're really losing the hype. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure. I mean, I'm still a little tiny bit hyped for it, but you know, before we end the video, I did just want to mention that, like, during like last month, I think, or a few months ago, they were talking about crunch time or. There was some article talking about, oh, they need to, like, put more hours in to crunch out the game just to make sure it's good on the weekend. Like, that, to me, I think is a little bit concerning. Like, I, and again, I understand we're in a pandemic, people are working from home, but I think just under these circumstances right now, it's just a little bit concerning for me, so I'm not sure. I think I'm probably just going to wait maybe one day after release, but again, um, no promises. They also mentioned in this comment that they might do a day zero patch so there will be an update file i'm assuming for the game just to you know get the bugs and kinks out but let me know and you know let us know what you guys think about cyberpunk in the comments below are you personally like, still excited for it or are you losing some interest or hype into it let us know your thoughts in the comments and yeah we will see you guys later my boy sergio give it up to sergio man uh, you know you can Give him to my boy Sergio. Give him some credit. Give him some credit. Yeah. Show yourself. You know, flex, Sergio. Promote yourself, Sergio. You gotta promote yourself. Yeah, Come yeah, on. yeah. Come on. Come subscribe to my channel at Chino062. There we go. There you go. See, there you hey, go. They know you. Hope y'all like our content today. And just support your content creators. For there you go. See, now they know you. See? Uh, cute. Yeah, there you go. But let us know what you guys think about Cyberpunk in the comments. And we will see you guys later. My name is Sizzle RJ and Sergio, and we are signing off. Peace out. Peace out.